said that, <coughs> we're going to do this, okay? So we're going to, now we're going to put the collar on, okay? We're putting the collar on the patient. So partner, come back down. So I finished the head portion. Now we're going to measure and put the collar on, okay? So he's holding cervical spine precautions for me and stuff. I grab my collar. All I'm quite simply going to do is I'm going to come and you're going to have to demonstrate proficiency on how you're going to measure. Okay, you measure between the, the mandible and the top of the trapezius. You come over here and you adjust it, okay, and you put it accordingly. You set it accordingly. Good to go. I'm just going to start there and see what happens, okay? So he measured it, okay, his trapezius to the angle of the jaw. Good to go. Came over here to the size line and we measured accordingly, okay? Now, when we do this, this is where you're going to end up having to work in coordination with your partner okay because he's going to have to lift the head slightly when i say slightly all he needs to lift is high enough for me to get this underneath the patient's head so we're not lifting his head doing this it's just slightly lifting so i can slide this underneath okay we're going to lift on hey we're going to lift on three so we can get this this um collar underneath them it's going to be on your count right Got okay it. on your count Three. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Okay, now we slide it underneath. Okay. Okay, let's stop there for a second. So that's the first move, right? And he's going to hold it there, slightly elevated, until I have the collar in position. Now I'm working with him. Who has a better angle of the collar to see if it's midline, him or me? Him. Okay, so I'm working. How does that look? Does it look like it's in the center? It does. Okay. Now I don't know about you people. And I, don't, I'm, I apologize, I don't mean to re refer you to his people, but I don't know about you folks, okay, and I hate to sound like this again, but I hope you are in charge of everything in your life, right? Mm -hmm. Just like here and stuff, I'm in charge of everything. So what do I do, okay? This, like, right, this portion right here, I'm always managing this part right here because you'll see by holding this up right here, you're going to see how much easier it makes as opposed to doing this. Keeping it above the shoulder and managing it is going to be the difference. So I'm asking, working with my partner, he's already still has it lifted. How does it look? Am I center? A little bit more to my left. To your left. Right there. Okay, good. Good to go? Yes. All right, go ahead and lower on your three. All right, one, two, three. Now he's lowered the head. Okay, now he's still holding C-spine. So now I'm bringing the collar over. He's just going to have to adjust his hands around the collar. Good. Good technique. I'm holding here, adjusting his head. Good. And now we hold it in place. Okay? Now we're securing the collar, okay? Mm -hmm. awesome. Now you're going to have an evaluator that's going to be doing this. He's going to be standing right here watching you, okay? And then he's going to come over the top of you and he's going to do, are you done placing your collar? You would say yes or no. If you're done placing the collar, he's going to ask the student, are you done placing your collar? Yes, I am. Step back for just a second. He's going to come over the top. He's going to look to make sure that it's not deviated, it's midline, and there's no infractions. Okay, if he says good to go, then you're gonna continue on with the scenario.